आई एम डॉक्टर निशित चंद्रा डायरेक्टर इंटरवेंशनल कार्डियोलॉजिस्ट एट फोर्टिस एस्कॉट्स हार्ड इंस्टीट्यूट न्यू डेली इंडिया टुडे आई विल डिस्कस अबाउट द कॉमन मिथ्स विच आर प्रिवेलेंट अमंग द जर्नल पॉपुलेशन अबाउट बेलूनिंग और स्टेंटिंग और वॉट वी कॉल इन मेडिकल टर्म्स एज एनजियो प्लास्टी नाउ वेन एवर वी डिस्कस एर वेर एवर यू थिंक ऑफ स्टेंटिंग और बलूनिंग दे आर लॉट्स ऑफ मिथ्स आर देयर इन जर्नल पब्लिक सम से दैट इट इज़ अ टेम्प्ररी फिनोमिना the the uh, once you get this done you have to come back again some says uh, the, that uh, th- this is uh, being done uh, very often and when it is even not required so what is the truth behind angioplasty or ballooning first of all let us know what do we mean by ballooning or angioplasty now ballooning or angioplasty is a technique in which we open the blocked coronary arteries by inflating a very minuscule balloon into the coronary arteries of the patient uh, and just by ballooning we can restore the blood supply but it had been seen earlier that after ballooning about 30 to 40% of the patient used to come back so and that was the origin of this myth that ballooning is temporary so why did they come back because of the reblockages so the reblockages were 30 to 40% uh, common after ballooning so what was the treatment what was the uh, how should we treat this so or prevent this reoccurrence for preventing this reoccurrence now in addition to ballooning we start deploying a stent what is a stent it is a very fine metallic mesh like structure like a spring of your pen and which after ballooning we deploy into the arteries through the same balloon catheter now both these stenting and ballooning procedures are done in a conscious patient patient is not required uh, for general anesthesia he is fully conscious he has been talking to us and the whole procedure takes about 15 minute to one hour maximum depending upon the number of arteries which we needs to open and now uh, the stents ha- have uh, a drug coat- coating which we call drug eluting balloons and these drug drug eluting uh, stents these drug eluting stents further reduce the risk of reblockages now the reblockage risk is only less than about 5 5% now the latest advance in stenting is the development of a stent which disappears which we called absorbable or dissolving stents the the beauty of these stent is that after a period of about 1 to 2 years the stents gradually dissolves in the blood stream and the artery becomes as pristine as possible as god has made so uh, the, the uh, after treating the blockages the artery becomes normal so these are the three different uh, types of stents which are available and we must know about them and uh, so uh, if you want to consult me in future you can consult me through www.librate.com or you can personally see me in my clinic at fortis escorts art institute new delhi or at my clinic, uh, residence clinic at uh, sector 93a expressway noida thank you